This is not a drill. I repeat, this is not a drill. Guys, 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 I'm so excited to tell you that SETI has detected a possible extraterrestrial signal from deep space. Oh my god, oh my god. What do you wear to meet an alien? My morph suit is in the wash. Oh, hi. If you don't know me, I'm Charlotte, and I love aliens. And if you're watching this channel for the first time, welcome to Information Overload. If you guys would like to connect with me, check out my own personal YouTube channel, just search my name, and also follow me on Instagram at Charlie Chaplin. Okay, 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 I know you're really excited about this, so I'm just gonna get straight to the point. A team of scientists from the Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence Organization, or SETI, has picked up several signal spikes from a star in the Hercules constellation. The Hercules constellation is 95 light years away from Earth. If the signal is legit, it means that it's from an alien civilization far more advanced than our own. Okay, I'm really excited right now in case you can't tell. Okay, so get this though, the signal was actually detected in May 2015 by the Russian Academy of Science, but it was kept secret from the international community. They're lying to us and keeping all the aliens to themselves. The star's designation is HDI 64595, and they say that it's very similar to our own sun. It's made up of nearly an identical metallic composition. According to the researchers who are trying to figure out what the heck the signal is, it came from an isotropic beacon, which could only be possible for a Kardashev type 2 civilization. Okay, so for those people who don't know what a Kardashev civilization is, scientists use the Kardashev scale to indicate how advanced a civilization is. To put it into perspective, our civilization is still a type 0 on the Kardashev scale. 0 0.7 to be exact. We aren't even type 1 yet! That's how lame we are and how advanced this other civilization could be. According to Soviet astronomer Nikolai Kardashev, Basically, a type 2 civilization would be able to harness the energy of their entire host star. They would be able to use something called a Dyson Sphere, which is a structure that takes the star's energy and transfers it to a nearby planet. Ok ok, so it cannot be said absolutely for certain that the signal is from an advanced civilization. But what the heck could be emitting that signal if it's not something built by extraterrestrials? But what scientists are certain of is that they need to direct their attention to this signal. Scientists plan to permanently monitor this target from now on. The SETI Institute the Institute already diverted its Allen Telescope Array in Northern California at the star, and Medi International will also use Panama's Boutique Optical Observatory to monitor it. The findings are planned to be discussed at a meeting during the 67th International Astronautical Congress in Guadalajara, Mexico, next month on September 27th. At this meeting, Elon Musk will also hash out his plans to colonize Mars. The future is here guys, and it's here in a big way. Ok guys, that is all I have to say about this, I hope you found that video informative, if you did, give it a thumbs up for me. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Check out IO on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And if you want to keep watching, there's a couple great videos floating right over here for you. Bye!